Hi, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today we are doing the monthly boxy charm. Um, it's a little late today. With COVID happening, I've been getting my boxes later in the month, and then that kind of throws me off. Um, I've also not been feeling well, and so I didn't record anything last week. So this week, I'm recording two videos. I'll do BoxyCharm this week, and then next week we'll have our snack crate video. Um, so if you're interested in watching and seeing what I got, then hang out with me. Okay, so I'm just gonna dive right in. Um, uh, first of all, I just wanna say, I did my makeup today. I have not done my makeup in so long. Um, it felt really weird to sit at my vanity and pull out my makeup brushes, uh, which also need to be cleaned. Don't tell anybody. Um, anyways, so I think I did pretty good. I kind of have a bridal look right now, but that's okay, who cares? All right, so first things first, this month's uh, theme is sunshine. So that's pretty cute. It's like lemons and pink and limes. I don't know if I've ever told you guys, but I'm allergic to limes and it's really sad because I love limes. So they're just teasing me and that's rude. All right, let's do the first thing. This is a Clean Skin Club Vitamin C Booster. I'm pull it out and see what it looks like. Ooh, that's really pretty. So it's a frosted glass bottle. Can you hear that? Um, really pretty, oh my goodness. I was wondering, like I know vitamin C needs to be in darker bottles or at least frosted bottles to protect the vitamin C. Um, oh, this is watermelon green apple. I'm gonna smell it right now. Hopefully I don't spill it because I always spill these things. Doesn't smell like any of those things. It smells like um, water park, like chlorine, but like a special chlorine. Anyways, so that is uh, $49.95 MSRP. All right, the next thing we have is, are these, um, what are these called? Makeup sponges, oh my goodness, by The Creme Shop. I'm guessing that's how you say it. And these retail for $22. Um, blender set, you get two. You get, they're both kind of weirdly shaped. So, okay, I'm gonna take them out because we need to experience them. Okay, so I took them out. They're very soft. They feel really nice, um, but they're both weirdly shaped. So this one's like got a butt, and then this one has a flat end on it like that. Very short, and this one's extra weird. Um, it's, no, can you see? There we go, the light was shining on it. It's got a flat butt, it's got this weird angled side. I don't know what you would use that for, but they do feel very soft, so. I'm gonna give them a try and we'll see how I feel about them. I'm not too picky when it comes to sponges, so it should be fine. And I think I said what it was, yeah, $22. All right, and then we have this studio makeup. We've been getting a lot more studio makeup kind of things. Is it gonna do it? Is it gonna do it? I don't think it's gonna do it. Ah. Anyways, um, it's Endurance Cream Eyeshadow by Studio Makeup. We've been getting a lot more Studio Makeup um, products in our boxes. I'm guessing that they probably like signed a um, deal with uh, BoxyCharm. It's very clear and sheer. So it's probably just gonna be like a glittery gloss on your makeup. Yeah, you can barely see that. It's just shiny. All right, well, it's pretty, but I don't know how much use I'd get out of it because it's very rare I put 
pointless shimmery stuff on my eyes. If I'm going to put shimmer, I'm going to do it with glitter. So anyways, I'll try it. We'll see how it goes. So this is $30? $30? No, not $30. $25. Still $25. I'm shook by that because... Is there really a market for this? It says it's pink, but it really is clear. Like, it's not anything. All right, well, it is what it is. You know, it's cute. We'll try it and see if I like it. All right, the next thing I have is this Ace Beauty. I don't know if that's how you say it, but it has one of those little accent things, and I think that's funny. <laughs> Come on, focus. Why does my camera hate it? Anyways, it's a bronze palette. Okay, these colors seem very not my colors, but that's okay. We could make it work. I could use it for contouring. Um, let's see. I'm going to try and do some on my arm. Let's see if I can do this. I never can do this right. That's the lightest. That's the second lightest. They're kind of chalky, to be fair. Ooh, this one's really dark. Ooh, that's a cocoa. Okay, so these three, there's not a huge difference. But this one, extreme difference. So, let me just wipe that off real quick. Um, I'll try it. I tend to like this brand, so I don't know. I don't see it being a problem. I really like the packaging. Super fall. I'm in fall vibes already. Um, I'm really tired of summer. I'm really tired of heat. Uh, heat does not make me feel well, and I'm over it. So I'm calling on you fall. This palette retails for $30. And then the last thing that we have in this box is this Alomar. Let me show the, is it upside down? I think it's upside down. <laughs> Do it with this hand. This Alomar Cosmetics Birthday Suit Lip Gloss. And this is, the, the color is Birthday Suit. So that's cool. It's got some glitter in it. Um, let's try some on. I've already got lip gloss on, but why not? Ooh, I like it. It definitely smells like, um, sorry, I'm looking in my viewfinder. It definitely smells like birthday cake, <laughs> vanilla e frosting kind of stuff. I like it. It gives it a good sheen. It's not super sticky. So I'll take it. And that retails for $15. So if I add up all these products, the total price of the box was $141.95. No, let me do it again. 50, 75, 105, 120, 142, no, 141.95. So that's not the best deal we've gotten. It's not the worst. These aren't the best products we've gotten. Not the worst. Um, the vitamin C booster serum will be really nice because I've been needing some more serums like that. Um, so I'm excited to try them. Um, I feel like Boxy Charms taken the basic box and kind of like mm, a little bit plateaued um, because they're pushing it for everybody to try to get the premium box. But we're in a quarantine right now, so I ain't paying more for a box. They're lucky I'm buying this one right now. Um, but maybe in the future I would go up to the premium one. It seems they have higher the higher quality products in that that they used to have in the basic box. Um, but I do still get the boxy Lux once every three months, so I don't think I need to move up to the premium. So we'll see. I'll think about it. Um, sorry, there's a gnat in my face, and that's rude. Go away. So anyways, that's what I've got for today. Um, I'm not going to do any try-ons today because my makeup's already done. I don't know what I was thinking. But um, maybe I'll use this vitamin C serum tonight and let you guys know how it goes okay here's me in the future 
taken off all my makeup, mostly, <laughs> and I'm gonna try the vitamin C stuff. So let's see. I'm gonna try to do it one-handed. This might be a mistake. I have to use my camera as my mirror. All right, let's rub it in. There weren't any instructions on this, so I hope I'm doing it right. Because if not, I really hope it doesn't mess up my face. It feels really smooth and refreshing and bring it down my neck. Um, I mean, I don't know what it's supposed to do, but it feels good, it smells good. So hopefully that means it's good. <laughs> All right, back to past Nikki. Anyways, thank you for hanging out with me and watching my video. Um, please be sure to subscribe. I'm gonna probably put it right here um, to my channel and like this video. Um, and as always, I welcome comments um, letting me know of videos you want to see. My channel's kind of all over the place. I don't really have any specific thing that I am focused on. I like beauty. I like home. I like food. I like all kinds of things. Travel, whatever. When we're allowed to travel again. <laughs> um, but I enjoy just doing whatever and finding fun videos to put together for you guys. So uh, let me know what you're interested in watching. And until next time, bye.